guys, welcome to the H&M Reloaded channel. Today we have a sponsor video from your friends at Loki Thor. This is the new J400, the J series, power bank and portable jump starter. This is 1000 start current and 2000 peak amp. So it's 1000 amp for starting current and 2000 peak amp. This will do vehicles up to 8 liter gasoline and 6 liter diesel, says it right there. This is a little monster, this thing. 2000 peak amp, like I said. And it's got a couple things on here I know you're going to love. Okay, here's a little bit of, I don't know if you can see it or not. Okay. Okay, now let's open it up and see what you get in the box. Okay. And here is the star of the show. Here it is, guys. Look how tiny this guy is. Look how tiny. This is the Loki Thor J400. And the really cool thing is, if you look over here, this will tell you when you have a bad connection. It'll tell you if the bad connection's on the positive or the negative. It'll tell you right here, see? And then if this is green, it should be able to start your car. But if they're yellow lights here, it means you have a bad connection. If it's a green light, you have a great connection. That is an awesome feature that I haven't seen on any other jump starter. All right. This is a 300 lumen flashlight, so you would hold the light button down right here. Just for about a second or two. It comes on. Then you have your strobe and your SOS. And then you just click it, just turn it off. And this will tell you the voltage in your vehicle. Just so you're aware, this will show the voltage along with many codes it will tell you like reverse polarity a code will pop up here um you know over current over protection you know all that stuff it'll come up with codes or it'll let you know in other ways i'll show you outside but yeah guys this thing is uh what is this thing this thing is literally a little over a pound one pound and i want to give you a little comparison this is the loki tour j401x look at this guy Remember this guy? J401X. And if you look, look at the difference. This is the J400, the 401X. Put them side by side. Look at that. Look at that, guys. They're crazy. This is like the little sister. We'll call it the little brother. But yeah, look at that. Look at the difference. And keep in mind, this is 2500 picamp. This is 2000. Look how much larger. Pretty cool, huh? Amazing. That's just a little reference point I wanted to show you. Okay. And this M right here is the boost button. So you would hold it. It says in the manual for five seconds, but it took about two to three seconds for that to come on. So even though it says five seconds in the manual, it took two to three seconds. And if you notice here, see how the yellow lights are lit? Then when you hook up your clamps, these will either be yellow or green, and then this will turn green, letting you know you could jump start but keep in mind when the boost button is pressed you're just bypassing the security features that's all you're doing so right now this has live power so if you put a jump starter cables on here and you touch them together you're gonna have a light show don't do that when the boost button is pushed all bets are off so shut it off yeah you see how it's green it's not cool how it's green up here but yeah you shut off that's it. Shut it off. So now the security features are back on again. Okay, that's pretty neat. Okay, let's see what else we get in the box. You get the Loki Thor card, you know, thanking you for buying their product, probably. Yep, exactly. And then you get the Loki Thor manual. Read it. And let's see what else you get. And you don't get too much. You get the charging wire and you get the jumper cables. That's it. Okay, you get the USB-C to USB-A, which I like. Charge things like your cell phone, stuff like that. So let's do that now. And this is IP65 rated, as you could tell. See the flap? See that? So you open it up, and this is water resistant. You plug it in port. Now you take your USB-C, and obviously you plug it into the bottom of your phone, and you see it's charging, see it? And this should have a code on there, like negative 5 or 10. Yep, negative 10 is on there showing it's charging. 
See that? Now, just so you know it's charging, I just want to show you. Um, where are we here? See how it says it's charging right there? There it is. See it? Charging. Boom. So now you know it's a nice charger as well. And I believe they said this is 8,000 milliamp hour battery. 8,000. So now you flip this wire around, put the USB-C in. Now you put this either in your computer, the USB-A, or you plug this into a USB-A wall plug that's not included and you can plug it in that way. Okay, so that's how you charge the device. Okay, so let's close the door. And these, and these flaps are really thick. They're good quality. Loki Thor makes a great quality product, as we know from previous products. And here is the 10 gauge wires, 200C, the clamps. And here's the EC5 connector. It. And this is going to plug in to right here. Goes in one way. Uh, where are we here? Oh, sorry, wrong way. Okay. And obviously the lights are on the same side as the port, which that's how it's supposed to be. Because now when your cables are on your battery, you have a flashlight to see what you're doing. Very cool. Some people don't agree with me on that. They think it doesn't matter if the light is on this side or that side. I mean, I think it matters tremendously. That's just me. But yeah, when you, we're going to put this right here like this. And I want to see what happens if you touch these together. They're touched together. Nothing is happening. No codes popping up. Nothing's happening. Because this is no spark. Okay? Now, if you were to hit the boost button, then do that, you're going to get sparks. So never click the boost button and fool around with this. This is user error friendly, except when the boost button is activated. Okay, so let's take this off, the cables. Okay, plug her in. Okay, and this, I think the screen will go off after about two minutes by itself. But yeah, this is about six 6.89 inches length, about 3.39 inches width, and about 1.39 height. So you put it down from the table to right here, it's about 1.39. Across length, it's about 6.89 inches, and the width, about 3.39, and it's about a little over a pound. It will take about an hour and a half to fully charge this up, at 3.0 amps okay so one and a half hours at 3.0 amps okay and like i showed you before the wire is in and out so you could charge your unit or you could charge items in or out like it says here see it where's it yeah see it in or out okay just so you're aware of that now let's go over a little little information this is the loki thor j400 like I said, jump starter and power bank. You could do 8 liter gasoline or up to 8 liter gasoline and 6 liter diesel. And this is the star of the show, the bad connection. It'll tell you if you have a bad connection. I can't wait to check that out outside. That's awesome. That's a game changer. You have a 5.75 inch large control center LCD screen. So it goes from about here all the way over since this is also considered a screen over here so it goes from here to here 5.75 inch screen okay you can get up to 25 starts on a single charge up to 25 jump starts on a single charge okay that's pretty cool 300 lumen flashlight SOS and strobe like I said the smart cables are they're spark proof reverse charge protection overcharge protection over current protection, short circuit protection, reverse polarity protection, low and high temp protection, over voltage protection, and over load protection. <laughs> All that in this little one pound machine. That, my friends, is amazing. Okay, let's see what else we got here. And the lithium battery discharge technology with the rate of over 80C. So 
The lithium battery discharge technology on this has a rate of over 80 C. The discharge current is two and a half times of other jump starters with the same battery capacity. Okay, it's two and a half times the discharge current of any other jump starter with the same battery capacity. You have a 12 month standby, but it's recommended every couple months to top off your unit, just to play it safe. All right, but yeah, guys, this is, uh, here's some little information on the back. I don't know if you're able to see it or not, but we're gonna try to, you know, there we go. Put it on there for you to see. Okay, yeah, we're gonna go outside in a couple seconds. I wanna test this bad boy out, because this is, wow, something this small. And it's amazing, because, you know, your cell phone, look at this, your cell phone is like, just about the same size. Cell phone almost the same size as a jump starter. And like I showed you before, I showed you the uh, Loki Thor J401X as a comparison, you know? But yeah, this is, wow, look at that, guys. This is just, it's amazing, amazing. Look at that. Ooh, pretty cool. All right, guys, we're gonna go outside in five seconds and test this puppy out. Let's go. All right, guys, we are outside with the Cadillac V8. And we want to check how many volts are in this battery. So here we go. We got what do we got? Uh, 2.6 volts. Is that 2.6? It says. Yeah. All right. 2.6 volts. Obviously, that's not enough to jumpstart. So let's turn on a little light here. Okay. Ready? Here we go. Now we're gonna check out our newest product. The Loki Thor J400 with the bad connection technology. Let's check her out. Okay, and you do not, it doesn't matter which cable you hook up first, guys. Don't forget, this does have security protections in there to protect user friendly. So user error won't happen, you know? So if you put the black on, it's not gonna spark, nothing's gonna happen, you know? Just so you're aware. Now, let's see what happens here. You ready, guys? I'm gonna put, bring you up here. I'm gonna bring you up. Okay, now, here we go. Negative's on the negative, and the positive is on the positive. Now, let's turn her on, see what happens. Okay, now you see over here, see? Now you see the countdown, it goes down. When it hits zero, watch. Watch here, okay. Both positive, negative are both showing yellow, which means it's not a good connection. Technically, they say you could probably start the car even with yellow. You could probably start it up. We're gonna give it a chance, really quick. Hold on, hang on. Okay. Uh, oh, there you go. Now they're both green. See it? Both green. Let's give it a start, guys. That's pretty cool, huh? Uh, uh, I hear the chiming. Here's the little buttons here, and then we come in. Wow! First shot, guys. <laughs> oh, first shot. That little thing jump started this car. Look at that. 4.7 volts was in there, and now you push the button here. Okay, there we go. Now we're going to count down. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Okay, 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 it tells you the voltage that's in your battery before time and how much voltage is being put into the battery. See? So let's do the reverse polarity now, guys. Let's do reverse polarity and see what happens, you know? Because I'm a big fan of security. <laughs> big fan. So, okay, we're going to hook up the negative to the positive and the positive to the negative here. See what happens? Whoa. Okay. See the code that popped up? 440, that's the code for reverse polarity. I wish it had an audible sound, just to let you know, because people could overlook just a flashing number. But keep in mind, nothing's happening. No sparkage, no nothing, because this is not letting out power, because of all the security features. Way to go, way to go, Loki Thor. Let's take this off. Let's just do it again for shits and giggles. You know, let's hook her up again the right way, okay? Okay, hook that up. And we're going to hook up positive again. Okay, and there's the countdown. It's going to count it down. When it hits zero, you're going to see over here. Okay, and as you know, one is green, one is orange. 
so there's a bad connection on the yellow but let's see if it'll start up even though it has a bad connection let's see if it'll start up because sometimes it does start up they say okay here we go ready okay click one time and start it right up guys car started right up so even though we had a bad connection the car started up right away so yeah guys that is the new Loki Thor J400 with the connection technology. It will tell you if you have bad connection or not by lighting up yellow color or green. That, my friends, is a game changer in my eyes. Loki Thor, you did a great job. All right, guys. Well, this is a V8 North Star Cadillac 2004. And this little jump starter with the little multimeter is no bigger than a little multimeter. Multimeter is basically the same size. I mean, how could something that powerful, I mean, how could something that small deliver that much power? Well, guys, hey, as I say always, shake your neighbor's hand. The fighting in this world has got to stop. We don't need it no more. Let's all get along. I love you guys. Click that subscribe button. Click the bell icon. Click all so you never miss an upcoming video or post of ours. We will be having a live stream in the next couple days. We will be giving away a gift card or two. Possibly some jump starters, possibly cameras. You gotta be a subscriber, all right? Guys, we'll see you soon. Love you guys. Peace out.